Hey guys, what's good? It's me, Jay Lee. You're watching Jay Lee Sees, and today, Jay Lee Sees The Walking Dead, Season 11, Episode 23. It's the penultimate episode of the series! I never got to know my mom, Lori. My brother Carl dreamed of a day when we'd all live together in peace. Oh my god, uh... My mom, Michonne, tried to hang up her sword. My dad, Rick, was searching for mercy. But we didn't know when we started this, that this would be the day everything changed forever. Oh my god! Oh my god, I ain't ready! I'm not ready, please! <laughs> Soldier kids without parents would end up at the city's children's school. You know where this place is? Find out. Oh, now this Tyler wants to help us. Now we've got the upper hand. <laughs> Here, Maggie. Thank you. What's in the box? Any thoughts on how you're planning to do this? But as far as I'm concerned, none of us are safe as long as she's still breathing. I'm assuming you agree. Pamela, we is coming for you. Together, you and I, we get this done. We don't need the others. Not a we. You kind of are a we. You can't just decide to be a wee when you want it and not to be a wee when you want it. It don't work like that. And be careful. I no pain. I always am. You make sure to come back in one piece. Oh god, famous last words. Yeah? I'm coming. No. But yeah. you hear. That's crap. <laughs> this isn't the future my brother wanted. Not what my mom and dad fought for. Not yet. Oh, she killed Chip Chip Bitch. I want to be part of that. Make what my family believed in real. Yes. I don't want you on the front line, but yes, kind of. Alright, but you stay right with me, mm -hmm. okay? Yeah, because Devil seems to be bulletproof, so stay behind him at all times. Surprise! I was going to help the whole time, I just wanted to make you sweat for a little bit. <laughs> First, I need to gather enough troops willing to make a move on Pamela. But if you and Max can keep the public fired up, it may give us enough cover to put things in place. But how can I best assist? By staying here. Mm. Out of sight. Mm -hmm. Sorry, sir. We're out of time. Oh. Rosie. I hope Massa don't go. <laughs> oh, I can't believe the next episode's the last one. That's so crazy. You know we're going to get our daughter back, right? Is that your faith talking? In you, yes. Yay. I'm Yay. She says she's happy we found you. Look, we've been looking since that night at Pamela's party. Society three away. We were desperate and that. I've been there. Oh, okay. Did we forgive him? The governor might have not even listened to you, but soon, the people in the Commonwealth will. Mm-hmm. You might be integral at some point, Tyler. A lot of people aren't happy about the verdict. It'll take some time to narrow down a suspect list. 
There have been reports of people going missing in the Commonwealth for a while. Huh? Oh. Maybe this time we get lucky. Just do your job, Michael, before more people get hurt. Oh, I think you might get hurt by the end of this episode, girl. <laughs> Keep an eye on him. I want a door-to-door -door search reporter. If he's found, shoot him on sight. It was one thing, them not noticing us, when it was dark, but in the light of day, you still ain't clocked that there's living, walking amongst the dead. Oh my god, it's gonna be so obvious as you break away. Or maybe it won't be obvious. I mean, it's obvious to me, but these are inefficient troopers, so maybe you'll get away with it. Oh, get out of our way, we're trying to escape. Where are they trying to round us up to? I don't know, but wherever it is, it seems a long way away. I don't want to be walking so slowly for so long. Uh, it's boring. <laughs> what? I never thanked you. Uh. For getting in front of those rifles. Oh, yeah. Thank you. I was going to say, should it be the other way around? You living. Making something positive out of your days, not that. Gotta keep me from giving in to anger. That's what he's been trying to do for years. I don't want to live out whatever days I got left in bitterness. Yeah, because bitterness just makes you more sick. The dead came for me. And yet I smile. And yet I smile. War came for me. Huh? And yet I smile. Oh my god, stop it! My chest, my throat. So why'd you tell the warden your name instead of mine? We'll need a better story about me than the one you've been telling. That when it mattered, I did something right. Oh! You all are better than me. And if you think I don't know that, then you haven't been paying attention. Boys. And Maggie overheard all of that. When do we finally forgive him? It's still so complex. You should be real proud of you. Your dad too. Carl too? The two are a lot alike. Why is this episode trying to tip me off the edge? I wish I had more time with him. We have more time to just remember them. Oh. Oh. We will, Jude. Yeah, when this is over, I'm going to tell you every story I remember about all the people that loved you. <laughs> I am going to be an emotional wreck. The last episode. If I'm already crying this episode. Where are you? On a train. Headed back to you. A train? We're bringing people. What are you planning to do? Change things. Yay! Think you'd be okay with that? Yeah. Yay! I hope no one eavesdropped on this shit. It's good to hear your voice. We got an alert. Oh, it's a swarm approaching from the east. Wait, is that the swarm that we're not purposely holding? Drake, run a night! Oh shit! Oh! I knew she was gonna go. I was like, why would you bring us back for no reason? To kill you off on screen, probably.
Oh no, quite a few of them didn't make it. <gasps> Who is that? Oh my god! Oh! Oh no, Lydia! Oh my days! Oh! Oh! So, we just wait for you to deal with the swarm and the lockdown? We're lucky. My girlfriend's coming back. And she's bringing her friends with her. Girlfriend! This trooper, she's gonna be a bit of an issue, I think. This woman one. Don't be side eyeing me, woman. I do not trust you. I don't care. I don't care. Dude, I can't lose him, please. He's gonna lose you. Oh no! Priorities, bitch. We'll find him. Yeah, we'll find him. As soon as we can. But you know what we gotta do. Oh my god, are we gonna chop her head off? Oh. Oh my god, we really are. Shit. Oh my god, Aaron, is you triggered? I'm triggered, and I've still got both my hands. I made it all right, yeah? yeah. This is the hardest part, okay? Oh! You are so loved, Lydia. Oh! We're gonna get you through this, okay? Oh no! I'm sorry. <gasps> Oh. <gasps> oh. Think we're good. Sure. All right. Let's go. I can't believe Judith is leading the troops. Oh my God! I'm so proud. So Luke, Jules, and Elijah should still be part of this horde. Right. What the hell happened? Beta <laughs> report. Beta report. These troopers are so useless. <laughs> Armor up. Heavy ammo. Once the others regroup, we roll out and knock the hell out of this thing before it gets to our city. What do you mean, armor up? They're already armored up. Are you telling me there's more effective armor that we haven't used this whole entire time? Open up, mandatory search! Sorry, nobody's home. <laughs> if even Eugene can take out a trooper, I've been saying it the whole time, need I say it anymore? Useless sack of shits. That benefits me, be as useless as you want. We need an answer. Elijah needs an answer. Hey, you need a doctor first. Elijah, Luke, Jules, we're all proud. No, 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 we don't leave them. Oh my god. <laughs> don't sweat it, okay? Less than enough. I'll find him. I'm going with you. No. Did you get that arm with that? No. Well, yes, but no, Jerry, please do not. No, why are we sending a man out who has a whole family? See you on the other side. No! Oh shit, we got back into the walls. Okay, I'm scared. <laughs> What's wrong? It's not made right. Oh, everything's not right. Come on, guys, we're almost there. Get down! Oh, shit! Michael Mercer, you're under arrest for treason by order of Governor Milton. Oh, shut the fuck up, bitch. Kids will be met with life in prison or death. I'll go. 
But you need to fortify the city's defenses before the swarm reaches the perimeter. The governor insists that the walls will hold. There's something going on out there, Vickers. You gotta listen to me. This is bigger than Pamela's bullshit. They're gonna regret detaining him. Oh my gosh. Uh... Oh really? Come on, Pamela. <gasps> no! Oh! Wake up, dude. Wake up! Whoa, no! Even she's shook. Oh my god! I felt it in my waters when Judith started introducing every episode. Oh no! No, you did this, you stupid bitch. You were there. We gotta go now. What happens when you shoot an extinguisher? Oh, Judith. Now. Oh yeah, some of them climb now, by the way. The rudders are climbing. I repeat, the rudders are climbing the wall. Oh, shit. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so much for the walkers not breaching the wall. Half of them climbed over, half of them just walked right through. The dead are in the Commonwealth, Governor. That's not possible. This was a standard. This was just supposed to be a lockdown while they cleared the swarm. The you dead. dumb fucked up. They are climbing the walls. Ma'am, place additional troops at my home and secure the surrounding area. Divert the swarm towards the lower wards. That will buy you time to gather essential personnel. Oh! Governor, that would leave thousands of citizens unprotected. She don't give a fuck. Hopefully this female trooper, she gonna see the light before it's too late. Fall back. Oh god, this seems and looks really precarious and dangerous. But they're so useless. They're pinning us in! Oh, that's actually so clever of them to do, but no, because that doesn't help us at all. Oh yeah, gang, they climb now. What the fuck? Oh no! <gasps> Careful! Oh, we don't have time to be pinned in. Judith been shot, girls. Put the back. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> oh, stay with us, bitch. my gosh at the beginning of the episode when you said today's the day everything changes i thought that was going to be a good sign no one's in a good situation here oh my god all right guys the penultimate episode is done and dusted wow so i'm not going to give a recap of what happened this episode because we've all just seen it so i'm just going to say my opinions on it i can't believe lydia has lost an arm I was so shook. I f for a second, once she got bit, I forgot amputation was a prevention cure thing. So I thought, oh my god, Lily is dead. But she's not. But it's still not good. Luke and Jules was able to meet up with the gang in the Commonwealth, but I did not see no Elijah. So where the fuck is he? 
Jerry's gone out to go find him, and um, he's nowhere to be found. Where's Jerry? Why has Jerry gone out? He's got a wife and kids. And Judith, we finally were like, yes, Judith, you've earned the right to be on the front line with us, but you've got to stick with Daryl because my man, he is bulletproof. But then Miss Milton, she aimed at Maggie and oh, Judith, she just jumped in front of the bullet. What a brave, stupid bitch. But she was moaning and groaning, so she didn't die on the spot. And hopefully we can try get her some help. But I do not know how, because we are all been trapped in by the walkers, the climbers, the face eaters, the lot of them. Hopefully Eugene can come to the rescue, because he's out and about slapping up troopers. Oh my god, I can't believe the next episode is the final episode. I go through conflicting waves of emotion of being excited that I'm finally finishing it. And... Absolutely distraught that I'm finishing it. I think I'm definitely going to need to bring some tissues with me for the last episode. Because I even cried this episode. I'm just so sentimental. I don't know how I'm going to deal. But wish me luck, guys. <clears throat> and until next time. Until the very end. Oh, my days. Stay safe out there. <laughs>